on you guys. I'm here and we're gonna go ahead and make some um, rice cereal treats. <clears throat> and before I get started, oh lord, some distant family now. Let me get that out right quick. Okay. <clears throat> so what I have in here right now is already a uh, hold on, wait, pull this right there. <clears throat> a fourth of a stick of a uh, butter flavored uh, Crisco, and it's one of the sticks. Really quickly before this stuff starts to burn, go ahead and add in this marshmallow fluff. So, <clears throat> need two and a half cups, or what is this? A seven ounce? Yeah, seven ounce uh, container. Let's try to get all of that out of there. Okay. I'll try again. Like I said, I won't. Get all this in there, and this little piece just doesn't want to stay away. Okay. Now, like I said, I need to hurry up and move fast. Let me see y <clears throat> okay. So, while this is doing this thing that don't want to come off, I'm going to need five cups of <clears throat> rice cereal. And right now, my one cup <laughs> is pretty much being utilized. So I'm gonna have to do half cups. I need to like move really fast. One. All right, so that right there is one cup. Like so I gotta move fast. So add it in. Take it all. And then just add the last of it. And pretty much I need five and a half cups. Remember. Right here's a half cup for me. Wondering <clears throat> why uh, I emphasize kosher and par on here is because of, um, the original recipe, of course, calls for uh, marshmallows, and most marshmallows have uh, gelatin in it. And most gelatin, I'm not going to spoil for you guys, but come from uh, not kosher sources. So, pretty much using the uh, marshmallow fluff. To uh, compensate, I'll just get this on the ground and I'll just sweep this all up later. <clears throat> Alright, so the last thing that I need to do is pour this into a pan. If I'm not mistaken, this is a 9 by 13 pan. <clears throat> Pretty much going to dump this in there. Press this off the bottom. guys wet your hands a little bit and this is how to oh it's not all right I this up. sorry you guys and then pretty much use wet hands so everything doesn't stick you know press it down and what I like to do is let this sit out for a little bit and you know kind of get a little bit like well of course it has to get hard but kind of like let it air out get just a tad bit still you don't have to do that but let this cool and normally you would line this with parchment paper. I'm not going to do that because trust me, it's going to pop right out. And I'll come back for cutting and eating. And you guys, here we go. I said I flipped it out. So this right here is actually the bottom. That right there is the top. It really doesn't matter. So what I like to do is pretty much cut these as evenly as I can into uh, 16. So half and I, I can already look until I kind of jack this up. That's all right. Okay, and then just, just a few more slices, one this way. And 
I say it, you dance. <clears throat> Those are the trees for you. That's how they look. Like I said, 116 is the serving size, unless you want to sit here and do, you know, what is it, uh, 113th. And personally, what I like to do is because I don't know when I'm going to get around to eating these, I just like to go ahead, throw them in a little plastic bag like this. I know it's kind of a waste. It is what it is. Damn it, I paid for it. Uh, roll the air out and leave it like this. So whenever I want one, I can just grab one and go. Or if I have company, over. You know, that good stuff. So there we go. Hopefully you guys enjoy. And uh, yeah, see you guys on that video. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and share. Bye.